ओके सो गुड मॉर्निंग एवरी वन टूडे आई एम गोन टेल यू द बेसिक मेंटेनेंस टिप्स ऑफ अ रॉयल इनफील्ड बाइक विच एवर बाइक यू हैव वेदर इट इज क्लासिक वेदर इट इज थंडर वर्थ स्टैंडर्ड बुलेट इलेक्ट्रा जी टी हिमालयन दीज आर द मेंटेनेंस टिप्स दैट आई एम गोन टेल यू इन दिस वीडियो इट्स वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट एंड वेरी यूजफुल इन डेली पर्पज सो डे टू डे लाइफ में आप ये अगर आप ये वाली मेंटेनेंस टिप इफ यू फॉलो दीज टिप्स आई एम श्योर डेफिनेटली बाइक की थोड़ी बहुत परफॉर्मेंस बढ़ेगी थोड़ी बहुत इसके लुक्स बढ़ेंगे और इसके बाद इंजन भी इसका थोड़ा स्ट्रॉग रहेगा सो लेट्स स्टार्ट वेरी क्विकली फर्स्ट थिंग इज़ द स्टार्टिंग ऑफ द बाइक सो एवरी डे यू शुड वार्म अप योर बाइक यू शुड वार्म अप योर इंजन जस्ट टू थ्री मिनट्स बिफोर यू राइड एंड आई प्रेफेबली सजेस्ट यू टू स्टार्ट द बाइक फ्रॉम द किक इट सेल्फ नॉट फ्रॉम द सेल्फ सो इफ़ यू आर स्टार्टिंग फ्रॉम द सेल्फ इट टेक्स मोर ऑफ द पावर फ्रॉम द बैटरी एंड इफ यू नॉट इफ आर स्टार्टिंग फ्रॉम द किक द होल ऑफ द इंज होल ऑफ द ऑयल गेट्स इन टू ऑल द पार्ट्स ऑफ द इंजन एंड इट विल बी डेफिनेटली हेल्पफुल इन मेनटेनिंग द इंजन ऑफ द बाइक सो दिस इज़ द फर्स्ट पॉइंट आई श्योरली रिकमेंड यू टू स्टार्ट एवरी मॉर्निंग फ्रॉम द किक इट सेल्फ वेन एवर यू स्टार्ट योर बाइक वैन वेन एवर यू स्टार्ट योर डे सो डोंट डू द सेल स्टार्ट यू कैन यूज सेल स्टार्ट आफ्टर डूइंग द फर्स्ट किक ऑफ द बाइक सेकेंड थिंग आई वॉन्ट टू टेल यू दैट यू शुड क्लीन योर बाइक ट्वाइस अ वीक If you are cleaning your bike twice a week, it will definitely help you in removing the rust or in the metal areas and in removing the dust from the whole of the bike. So your bike looks so fantastic and looks so beautiful if you are cleaning your bike twice a week. So the third thing I'm going to tell you is this you should check the tightness of the bolts using the toolkit which you have in your bike. You should check the tightness of the bolts Uh, from the tool toolkit you can easily tighten the bolts in in your home also you should not go to service center for this you can you can easily tighten your bolts from the toolkit that has been provided to you so if you want to and also these are the other uh, bolts as you can see so you should tighten them before uh, going for 100 km ride or before going for 200 km ride so you can do it by your own you should not go you are not supposed to go to service center for these these are the bolts as you can see these are the main engine engine bolts the rear bolts as i have already told you another thing i want to mention that you should check the lighting system of your bike your bike should all the lights are get, uh, all the lights are on when you were you start the bike these are the headlights main lights these are the additional lights that i have added added and i have already mentioned these in the my, in my previous video should you check the lights the indicators are also running fine because it's very useful in night riding as you can see these are the tail lights these are the indicators so you you should check these lights very often so this is the fourth point that i have mentioned is you should check the lighting system of your bike another thing that i want to mention is so you should check the engine oil and i would suggest you to change the engine oil every 5000 km so after 5000 km you should change the engine oil so this will definitely help you in the engine maintenance this is the where you can change the engine oil another thing that i would like to share with you is you should clean and lube the chain every 500 km well my chain is not properly clean right now but you should clean the and lube the chain every 500 km i do it by my own and because i have a more tool uh, chain lube oil so i i do it by my own this is a very important tip uh, if you are going for long run and if you normally day to day life just see the odometer every 500 km please clean and lube the chain another thing i would like to tell you that you should check the battery if your horn is not blowing properly you can see i have not started the ignition if your horn is not blowing properly then there might be some battery issue with the bike so if please check the battery so you should check the battery if if you are having any problem with the lights or if you are in any problem with the sound of the horn so this is another point that i have uh, shared with you and the last one that i want to share with you is very important this is the royal enfield bike the royal enfield bike is a cruiser bike this is not a sport bike so you should drive it like a cruiser you should constantly increase the speed you should not increase the speed at a stretch i have already mentioned this in the video when i made a video regarding how to increase and maintain the mileage of the bike i already told you this point basically in that video that you should not exceed the speed instantly and you should not put excess pressure on the throttle so this is the very basic point of maintaining the royal enfield bike because this is not a sports bike this is a cruiser bike so for cruiser 
you the engine is is the engine is totally made up like a cruiser you should not exceed very harshly just exceed normally it's constantly and it will it will definitely help you increasing the mileage and overall maintenance of the engine so guys if you found this uh, maintenance tip that i have discussed in this video is very worthy and very useful so you apply this maintenance tip to your bike and please let me know how would you find it after applying this and if you really like the video please do hit a thumbs up to this video so that i would get to know that what are uh, that what are the maintenance tip that i have told you whether it is good or not and please subscribe the channel because subscribe and you will get the notification when i upload the next video and thank you so much for watching this video enjoy your uh, evening and enjoy with your family enjoy with your friends and goodbye good luck take care ride safe ride happy ride confident please follow these maintenance tips and i'm definitely sure that it will get stronger your overall bike maintenance will get stronger so thank you so much for watching this video do take care and please stay tuned to my channel thank you so much bye bye